Here we go with the product review on 2015 Panini Contenders. Um, this product was slated to release the end of December, and it actually got released January 2016. So, um, box prices started off about 130, 140. I think right now they're about 120, 130. So they're about the same. Uh, it's been out for about a month and a half, and uh, pretty standard release. Um, five to six hits per box. Uh, usually you get five autos and one points card, or six autos. So, and one or two on cards per box. So. That's something I look for. So this, let's just go down the box breakdown of one of the boxes I broke. This is all the base. A veteran base, 4 or 5 per pack, times 24. So about 100, maybe 105. And then the insert sets. I think this is pretty standard for what you get in a box right here. So one championship ticket, Cam Newton to 99. That's an MVP contender. Touchdown tandems. Round numbers, one of those. Two rookie of the years. Uh, four pennants and one of the legendary contenders of Barry Sanders. So those are the inserts. Nothing too crazy there. Pretty standard inserts. And then the hits. In my box, I had six autos. I had one that was on card. So Trey Flowers, Deron Smith, and these the uh, the variations have just just the logo, not not the logo on the helmet. So that's what an easy way to find them. Some of these uh, lower known players lesser known players have some uh, really short printed cards so that's something to look at if you open a box of this. Geno Grisham, Jeremy Langford is on card, Quandre Diggs and Dominique Brown. So that was my box. Um, nothing really too crazy in the auto. The auto is in this box. Um, let's go through the different categories of this product. The uh, first category as always great ability and for these I'm going to give it a 4.5 out of 5. The uh, scale runs from 1 to 5 so I mean it's a it's a white bordered card not not a lot can go bad with with a white bordered card unless they're you know dinged in packing but <clears throat> as long as they were shipped correctly it looks like the uh, Saturn won't be an issue on these for people looking to grade um, I think you'll get some really good grades on this product just the way the foil is and everything it, tend, it lends itself to uh, give you better grades the one thing I'd, I would note though is these these foil cards the uh, parallels that are numbered I, th I think these will be tougher to grade just because they'll be dented and chipped just the way foil is I think the top right of this even has a little nick too so that's just something to look out for if you're going to grade the uh, foil insert so next up is design and to me this is a 4.5 out of 5. I mean I love con containers. I love the classic look of it. I mean the card just it looks like a ticket. looks like a ticket into a football game. It's awesome. It's always been one of my favorite sets and th this year is uh, no different. They did a really nice job with the design. I think the uh, last scene appeal will be with the uh, rookie autos. Um, they look they honestly look great this year. Photos look good. Backs look good. So I'm very impressed with the design. Um, as for box value, this is where the product kind of falters, in my opinion. Um, I just feel like uh, you're spending 120, 130 bucks for a hobby box. I just don't feel like you're getting. I mean, unless you hit something big, obviously. But I think the majority of the boxes you're not going to do. You're going to get probably I don't know 40 bucks back on this product. That's that's what I'd say. I mean, this base doesn't have any value. These inserts are you know 50 cents to a dollar a piece. And then the autos. I think most of these autos are two to three dollar autos. So I'd, I mean, you're looking at the average. You're probably gonna get forty, fifty. I mean, maybe not even that. So I think this is that's where the product is kind of kind of stumbles a little bit. And then uh, rookies, I gave it a two point five out of five. I mean, if you look at the all the cards I pulled in the box, these are all veterans. Then all the inserts. There's what three, and then. Uh, obviously the uh, rookie ticket autos but so in the whole box we got like nine nine rookie cards that's that's pretty low in my opinion um next up is hits uh, i gave it a four out of five i i know you get six hits and that's 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 a lot of hits but i think the quality of the hits is something you should take into consideration i feel like um a lot of the hits you get like like these these cards are <laughs> got just like a half hit i mean those aren't the best hits, and that's what that's what uh, this product has a lot of, and it's, that's how all contenders' years are. That's how it's always been. So th there's no surprise there. So doing the averages of the five categories, I gave it a 3.6 out of five. So not bad, not not great. I, I think if you want to try one box, you should. But I think if you're hoping to.
do well in a case, you're going to be pretty disappointed with this one, guys. That's it.